Hi guys, this is Shivariti. Welcome to Git Tutorial. In this session, I am going to explain Git Merge command. So, one of the key feature of uh, Git is merging. So, in the case of other version control systems, the merging part has to be taken care by the developer or the um, uh, where it requires manual effort. But in the case of Git, it has provided the capability of merging the code from one branch to the another branch automatically where it is a very minimal effort is required from the developer perspective hence let us go and see how git works uh, for merging in order to do the merging we need to have a separate branches so currently uh, in my local um, git repository i have only one branch that is master so i am going to create one more branch so that i can uh, from the created branch i can match to the master branch so in order to create a branch git branch test so this test branch is going to be created from the master branch so i created a branch test if i see branch command again it shows me two branches currently it is pointing to the master branch and a test branch is just now we created from the master branch so in order to switch to the test branch we need to issue the git command git checkout test now it has switched to the test branch now what i am going to do is i am going to add a few files and i will uh, do some modification to the test branch once i do these changes i will commit to the test branch from there we can merge it to the master branch we will see in this session so what I am going to do is I am going to add few more files to this uh, test branch that is test 8 so this is testing for match request ok I have added one file and I am going to add one more uh, one more file that is um, test 9 sorry add nine this is testing for match request i have two files and also what i am doing is i am going to uh, move some files so git mv add one dot txt to add ten dot txt and also I am going to perform some more operations git rm add to dot txt git status now it is going to say these files now what I need to do is the newly added 789 text file I need to add it to the staging area and then I will commit it so git and I am going to add all the things whatever it is there and uh, git if I see status right everything now in the staging area now I want to be uh, I, now I want all these changes go as part of the commit so git commit I am saying that uh, modified files as a message now if I see the git status everything is now clean because whatever the changes it is happening it is applied to the test branch and if i see the directory structure of for this um, changes git k now git k will show the browser representation of the files how it looks like as initially we have created this branch from the master and uh, we have created a test branch where we have committed these changes and if you see here so what is happening is it got deleted this file and similarly it has renamed from the add1.txt to the add10.txt and uh, we have added three more new files so those files it is already added new file add like that it has added three files now what i need to do is whatever the changes i have done for this test branch now i want to merge it to the master branch so in order to merge first of what you need to do is you need to go to the context branch of where you want to match now in this scenario i want to match my code changes to the master branch so i have to first switch to the master branch in order to switch git 
check out master now a branch is switched to the master if you see the master branch here there is no files whatever we have done for the test branch because that files will be in the test branch here it is the master uh, file so those changes are not here now what we need to do is those changes we need to merge to the master branch in order to merge we need to issue the command git merge and which branch we need to merge this is the test so enter now what it has done see it automatically taken care of all the merging things that means we have deleted a old file add2.txt it has reflected and we renamed add1.txt to add10.txt it has taken care of it it has taken care and also we have added uh, 789 files to the test branch so those changes also it has reflected here so this is the flexibility git provide us so uh, that the manual effort of merging the code will be removed hence get is very uh, flexible in merging the code from one branch to the another branch for example uh, now let us talk about another scenario so first what happens is i have i have taken the code code from the master uh, that means i have created a test branch from the master then i have done some changes to the test and then i have finally uh moved all these changes whatever the changes happening to the test to the master branch but by the time you are trying to uh merge it to the master master also have a some commits then in that scenario what will happen so we will see in this case so now what i am doing is in the uh, currently i have mod uh, currently test is equal to the master now what i am doing is master i am going to add one more file here uh add 11 this is add 11 okay now what i'm doing is git add add 11 dot txt git commit m and then i'm saying that added add 11 dot txt sorry okay now i had it now what i am going to do is i am going to the test branch again i switch it to the test branch here what i am doing is i am going to add one more file here like uh, add 12. Dot, add 12 text this is testing for match now here also i am committing uh, that means i am adding this file uh, add 12.txt and i am going to commit this one git commit message is uh, added add 12.txt sorry add 12.txt now what happens is i created a test branch after that i have merged to one one time and again what i have done is i went to the master branch where i have done the commit now again i am coming to the test branch here i have changed some file and now i want to match this test branch to the master branch in that case what will happen is git check out master now i want to match test changes to the master now uh, get match test now it will ask for the some message because what happens is you created a branch from the master after that somebody actually merged the code changes to the master branch sorry somebody actually committed few changes to the master hence what this merge is going to do whatever the changes you have done that will be go to this main branch also that is the reason it is asking for what is the reason you want to merge to the test so that those changes and the latest changes it will merge together so you need to do you can specify message here or by default it will be match test dot 
txt uh, txt one or if you want to specify something so you can do it like um, here you can specify like this is testing testing match request and then escape colon wq it will be save the changes now it will be automatically taken care of the merging these two version two branches at a time previous case there is a lean there is no linear development that means only one developer is working on the particular uh, branch and he committed because main branch didn't change anything but in this case what happens is some other developer who has taken the code from the production he has actually done some changes he pushed it to the master branch later the second developer is trying to push his code changes to the master branch now these two developer code has to be sync with each other that is the reason they get automatically taken care of merging to these two files together this is the beauty of the uh, git while merging the two branches are parallelly it supports the linear development automatically it will taking care of the merging the code without getting the any code complex the get is uh, the git is taking care of all the merging part hope this concept is clear if you have any questions please comment on my youtube video thanks for watching have a nice day